Good morning all. Welcome to Exam Nurse 365. Hope you all are good and safe. In this video, we are going to discuss about the important current affairs questions and answers on 16th and 17th October 2022. Do watch the video till the end. We will ask you a question at the end of this video. Please type your answer in comment section. Let's begin the session. which is the only state in India that has achieved Jal Jeevan mission target for 2022 Q1 and Q2. Tamil Nadu Tamil Nadu has emerged as the only state which has achieved the target for 2022 Q1 and Q2 for Jal Jeevan mission with 69.57 lakh households provided with tap connections till date. What is Jal Jeevan mission or Hargar Jal Yojana? Jaljeevan mission is envisioned to provide safe and adequate drinking water through individual household tap connections by 2024 to all households in rural India. Let's talk about Tamil Nadu. Where is the capital of Tamil Nadu? Chennai. Who is the chief minister of Tamil Nadu? M.K. Stalin. Who is the governor of Tamil Nadu? R.N. Rivi. India's first Kadavur Slender Lowering Sanctuary will set up in Tamil Nadu. India's first Dugong Conservation Reserve will set up in Tamil Nadu. Note down this point. India's first Kadavur Slender Lowering Sanctuary and India's first Dugong Conservation Reserve will set up in Tamil Nadu. Let's move to next question. How many digital banking units DBUs? were dedicated to the nation by Prime Minister Narendra Modi? The answer is 75. Prime Minister Narendra Modi dedicated 75 digital banking units DBUs, to the nation through video conferencing. Let's talk about DBU. The DBUs have been set up with the objective to ensure that benefits of digital banking reach every corner of the country. It will provide a variety of digital banking facilities to the people. These are opening of saving account, balance check, print a passbook, transfer of funds, investing in fixed deposits, loan applications, applying for credit and debit cards, pay taxes and bills. Who is the Minister of Finance, Nirmala Sitharaman? Who is the Governor of RBA, Shakti Gandha Das? Which country has won the women's cricket title at Asia Cup 2022? The answer is our country, India. The Indian women's team won the Asia Cup 2022, defeating Sri Lanka by 8 wickets in the final. Which country hosts the tournament? Bangladesh. The 2022 Women's T20 Asia Cup was the 8th edition of the Women's Asia Cup tournament, which took place from 1st to 15th October 2022 in Silhet, Bangladesh. Let's move to the next question. World Food Day observed on 16th October. World Food Day is an international day celebrated every year worldwide on October 16th to commemorate the date of the founding of the United Nations Food and Agriculture Organization in 1945. The day is celebrated with the aim of highlighting the millions of people worldwide who cannot afford a healthy diet and the need for regular access to nutritious food. What is the theme for World Food Day 2022? Leave no one behind. Not on this point. The theme for World Food Day 2022 is Leave no one behind. Who has appointed as India's next ambassador to Kuwait? Dr. Adar Swaika. Dr. Adar Swaika, a joint secretary in the Ministry of External Affairs, has been appointed India's next ambassador to Kuwait. Let's talk about Kuwait. Where is the capital of Kuwait? Kuwait City. Who is the Emir of Kuwait? Nawaf Al Ahmad Al Jabbar Al Sabah. Who is the Crown Prince of Kuwait? Michel Al Ahmad Al Jabbar Al Saba, Prime Minister of Kuwait, Ahmad Nawaf Al Ahmad Al Saba. What is the currency of Kuwait? Kuwaiti dinar. So, who has appointed as India's next ambassador to Kuwait? Dr. Adar Swaika. 
Railways Minister Ashwini Vaishnav inaugurated India's first aluminium freight rail at which railway station? Bhubaneswar. It is in Odisha. Union Minister for Railways Ashwini Vaishnav inaugurated India's first aluminium freight rail at Bhubaneswar railway station in Odisha. What is the specialty and aim of this movement? The intensely built rake will reduce carbon footprint due to lower consumption of fuel. The freight rake has been developed by Hindalco. The aluminium rakes have been developed with the aim to modernize freight transportation and enable large carbon savings for Indian railways. Let's talk about Odisha. Capital of Odisha, Bhubaneswar, who is the Chief Minister of Odisha, Naveen Patnaik, and the Governor is Ganeshi Lal. Robbie Coltrane passed away. He was an actor. Scottish actor, comedian, and writer Robbie Coltrane, who played the lovable half chained Rubies Hagrid in the Harry Potter franchise, passed away. Coltrane featured in every Harry Potter movie from Sorcerer's Stone in 2001 to Deathly Hallows Part 2 in 2011 and was much beloved for bringing the character from J.K. Rowling's book series to life. Which country will host the 19th General Assembly of Interpol from 18 to 21st October? The answer is India. India is hosting the 19th General Assembly of the International Criminal Police Organization Interpol from 18 to 21st October in New Delhi. Let's talk about Interpol. The General Assembly is Interpol's supreme governing body, comprising representatives from each of 195 member countries. It meets once a year, so Interpol has 195 member countries. India is one of the oldest members of Interpol and joined the organization in 1949. Not on this point, India joined the Interpol in 1949. The role of Interpol is to enable police around the world to work together to make the world a safer place. Who has launched the first Hindi version of MBBS course books in Bhopal? Amit Shah. Union Home and Cooperation Minister Amit Shah launched an MBBS course in Hindi for the first time in the country in Bhopal, Madhya Pradesh. Amit Shah announced that medical education is starting in Hindi and soon engineering studies will also start in Hindi. Translation of engineering books in eight languages has also started across the country. Who is the Minister of Education? Dharmendra Pradhan. Let's talk about Madhya Pradesh. Where is the capital of Madhya Pradesh? Bhopal. Who is the Chief Minister of Madhya Pradesh? Sivraj Singh Chauhan. Who is the Governor of Madhya Pradesh? Mangubai C. Patel. Who has appointed as India's next ambassador to the Republic of Kenya? Avdar Singh. Avdar Singh, a director in the Ministry of External Affairs, has been appointed as India's next ambassador to the Republic of Guinea. Let's talk about Guinea. It is a country in West Africa. Where is the capital of Guinea? Conakry. Who is the interim president of Guinea? Mamadi Domboya. And the prime minister is Bernard Gomo. What is the currency of Guinea? Guinean franc. Let's check previous two question and answer. Which state has announced India's first cardboard slender lorry sanctuary? Tamil Nadu. In a first time in country, Tamil Nadu government notified cardboard slender lorry sanctuary covering 11,806 hectares in Karur and Dundukal districts. Let's talk about slender lorries. The slender lorries are the genus of lorries native to India and Sri Lanka listed as an endangered species by the International Union for Conservation of Nature, slender lorries has a wide range of ecological roles to play in the terrestrial ecosystem. India's first Dugong Conservation Reserve will also set up in Tamil Nadu. Not on this point also. Let's check question of the day. Scientists have found new ecosystem named the Trapping Zone 
in which country? Please type your answer in comment section. Thanks for watching. Hope you liked the video and you have received some important points. How was the video? If you find this helpful, please like the video and subscribe to our channel and share it with your friends. To get daily current affairs notes, please subscribe to our channel. See you tomorrow. Bye. Take care.